Starting the new year out with a bang, we're going to be giving away our entire collection of the Soul Fusion series. All you have to do is enter is click the link in the description down below and follow the instructions to get entered. Good luck. See you guys in the video. Peace. What is up everybody? It's your boy T right here from the Comic Crew back at you guys today with another great opening. Um, as you guys see in front of you guys here, we have the Judgment of Light Deluxe Edition. This was part of that special care package that was sent to us by our boy Jorge. Um, so yeah guys, we're going to jump right into this. Um, I've, I've actually opened only one of these before and it's been a while back. So um, I know you get like, there's like some super rare variant cards. You can get like Vampire Kingdom and uh, Dragon Shield as well as like Flying Sea and uh, it's an Archfiend card. I can't remember the name of it. Uh, didn't say but yeah anyways guys so this is really really cool uh, it's kind of kind of older now if you uh, kind of actually look at it now it's been a few years since this is uh, released I can't really exactly remember the actual year but um, you get nine judgment of light booster packs one of two foil preview cards from the upcoming shadow specters booster two foil versions of common cards uh, from judgment of light and uh, one pack of promo sleeves and I believe this was back when they actually um, when they actually still did like uh, ghost rares or ultimate rares in the pack, and I know we are not guaranteed soup, we're not guaranteed a foil in these. So, um, and the boxes themselves, so we get like a rare, like a storage box that's like a collectible one or whatever. Where to open this at the side? Okay, so we'll see which one we get here. Okay, you see a little a little sun there, a little Teletubbies action. Okay. Cool. Pop the top on the crack the tombs here. All right, looking. That's how they have it stored all in here. So these are really cool. You can actually pick these up too. They're fairly reasonable online. So there's our sleeves. Those are pretty sweet. But we're not going to be rocking these sleeves, guys, because we got to rock with our boys, Aperium Duelist, where you can rock these sick mats and you can rock these dope, dope illusion sleeves. So today, guys, we are going to be rocking with. The uh, Starfoil Illusion Sleeves. You guys can pick yours up at ImperiumDuelist.com. Uh, link is in the description down below. Use code KonamiCrew10. You'll get 10% off your order. We'll save a little bread and, you know, we'll make a little bread. So that's always good to do. So there's our nine packs of Judgment of Light. And somebody's texting me. All right, so there's the beginner's guide. If you guys were new at the time this came out, this would teach you the game, but the game's changed, so I wouldn't really focus on this at all. Let's open up our promo pack. Let's see what we got here. Looks like we got Arch, we got Archfiend card that I was that I was talking about. Let's see what we got here. We have uh, Archfiend Emperor, the uh, the first Lord of Horror, Flying Sea, and we got Dragon Steel. That's pretty cool. Thought we were only supposed to get two cards. Huh, maybe. Oh, you get two ver you get two foil versions of common cards. So we got flying C and uh, so you're guaranteed these. This is the one that you're not guaranteed. So there's that. And uh, yeah, let's see. You can kind of you take that little holder out. And you get yourself a little cool card storage box. You know, put your lid on there. Pretty cool. There's something you know. They don't do it anymore, but back in the day they used to. I guess not even. It's probably what been four or five years since this came out, maybe. There's no. I don't know. But yeah, this ha I, these have like Star Eater in it. It's also got like uh, number uh, C39 in it. So there's there's a lot of great cards in this. So we have a Kujakaku, Kujaku Jaku. It's like a big peacock with snakes in its feathers. Uh, vertical landing. Uh, Bujan Fidel, Shark Caesar, V Salamander. Ooh, and we got him on the. I just spoke him up, man. Number C39 Utopia Ray Victory. This is actually a really, really great card. One of the better cards in the set. And uh, yeah, it's actually the cover art card. So that's cool. We started out with that. And let me let me show you guys. In my opinion, these sleeves go best on like uh, super rares. It just makes them pop, dude. And look there, dude. Look there. We just turned our C39 into a Starfoil Super Rare. Pretty dope. So we'll put that there. And we have a Umbral Horror Willow the Wisp, Bujing Ward, and a Bujingi Ophidian. So we'll just put all, all of our other cards there if we don't pull Hog. I 
And I'm going to say this is older. Yeah, this is older, so you're not guaranteed like any hollows out of here. So a super rare is actually a good pull. You know, back in the day, if you pulled a super rare, it was actually you know something. Ice Princess Ziffort, Xyz Agent, Shark Caesar, Bujan Fidel, Brotherhood of the Firefist Boar. We have Googly Eyes Drum Dragon. That always cracked me up, man. Xyz Revenge Shuffle, Bujing Ward, and an Umbral Horror Will O the Wisp. Yeah, so this is this is really nice of uh, Jorge to send some stuff like this in. So we actually have a bunch of stuff that we're going to be opening from him. So it's really really cool. We have single purchase, Mega Phantom Beast, Colt Wing, Vein Betrayer, Star Seraph, Sword, D Z W, Chimera Clad. Ooh, and we have a Rank Up Magic Numeran Force for an Ultra Rare. Go ahead and sleeve this bad boy up as well. That's what that's what it looks like when you have an ultra rare in it. It's cool, but I, I, I like the, for some reason like the super the super rares. You know, there's not a whole lot going on, so when you throw them in there, it looks great. When you start getting into some of the more rarities, it can you know maybe take away from them a little bit, but still looks dope on them regardless. Still a dope sleeve. Uh, Kujaku Jaku, Mecha Phantom, Beast Colt Wing, Intercept Tomato, Lujing Wolf, Confronting the Sea, and an Xyz Reception. Madolce Chicolets and Spell Recycler. There's some of those those C cards, you know, Max C, Flying C. The Atmosphere, XYZ Agent, Brotherhood of the Firefist, Caribou, Super Defense, Robot, Elephant, Bujingi Carnation, or Bujing Carnation, excuse me, Super Defense, Robot, Leo, Sargassi Lighthouse, XYZ Revenge, Shuffle, in Sonic, Sonic Boom, Sonic Boom. There we go, guys, let's keep jumping in this. Sorry about the autofocus in that other video as well. Um, we'll just start having to use, uh, you know, just single focus from now on because the autofocus just goes crazy. For some reason, it wants to focus in over here, and I had like a little summon skull sitting here. And I thought that was it. I moved it. It still wasn't working. So it is what it is. We have Flying C, Star Sheriff Sword, the Atmosphere, Xyz Agent, Corrupted Keys. Oh, and we got another super. We have a C, 104. Umbral Horror Masquerade. Man, I don't know if you guys can get a good look at that dude. That dude looks wicked. Black and White Wave, Umbral Horror Ghoul, and Junk Blader. All right, we'll go ahead and sleeve the Super Air up, even though even though it's not that great of a Super Air, we'll go ahead and sleeve them up anyways, just so you guys can check out these sleeves. We have a Sargassu with a DD Battlefield, Bujingi Wolf, Reverse Glasses, Intercept Tomato. We have a number 104 Masquerade, Black and White Wave, Bujingi Turtle, XYZ Reception, Cheap, Cheap, Cheap. All right, guys, we have two packs left. Hopefully, we can, you know, pull something dope. If we could get a Star Eater, whether whether or not it would be the, I believe it's, it's Ghost in here. You can get a Ghost Star Eater. Or you can get a uh, um, an ultra rare even Archfiend Emperor, the first Lord of Horror. So that was one of the ones that we got in the uh, promo. So there's the difference in them. Those look a lot better as a ultra, I have to say. And here we go, guys. Can we can we pull some heat? Let's see what we got here. We have a Kujaku Jaku. Umbral Uniform, Fish Board, we have Tour Bus to the Forbidden Realms, and No Hollow. So, that is a cool card though, man. Tour Bus to the Forbidden Realms. Flip, add one Fiend type monster from your deck to your hand, except a Dark or Light monster. So, there's that, guys. We did pull some decent cards though. We got, we got a C39, which is really cool. 
and uh, we did get an ult uh, ultra rare rank up magic Glimmer force so if you guys enjoyed today's video please show it by dropping a like on this video as well as make sure to follow us on twitch twitter and instagram all are at the konami crew and all are linked down below get into the giveaway guys i want to see one of you guys who always support the channel win so make sure you guys get all your entries in and uh until the next time as always it is your boy t right here from the konami crew i love you guys i'm out